My life be like wow, yeah. My life be like Guys, this is Zep Moff and I found PC and today I've got an, ep an episode, a game of Call of Duty Black Ops on the PC. Today I'm using uh, SSD on uh, Villa, that's one, and I'm using the Commando Silence with a nice little bit of a tingy blue camo. And first round, I'm defense, saw a lot of action here and I'm just going to wait because they've got to attack but the guy on the minimap comes and knifes him in the back. So obviously I push up now. I'm just gonna take his gun. So I'm doing this in a uh, theater mode, so you don't see certain things like you won't see the round winning kill cam, and you won't see guns picked up on the floor, and you won't see the last scoreboard. But I'll tell you that at the end when we get there. So I'm gonna take this as I can talk about Black Ops and what I think about it so far. Um, I have lots of mixed opinions about Black Ops so far, and. Uh, I've loved it, I've hated it, and all that. But, um, watch this. Whoa, <laughs> I actually didn't notice him until he started shooting me because I was so focused on getting to that bomb. So, I'm surprised he didn't get me, but thankfully I did. That was a, that was a pretty nice good as he got turned on. So, anyway, um, so, I came, I was really hyped up for this game, and then I found out about the sniper patch. And yep, I'm going to talk a bit about my opinion on that patch. I thought, um, I think they could have concentrated on other stuff, like making sure the PC version didn't lag. Because for the first, I think it was two days, it, the game was unplayable. Even in single player, the uh, lag was extreme. It was like there was graphical lag, so it wasn't like internet lag, so like the connection was bad. You actually were um, oh, a nice little long shot there. This is my first game using the commander as well. Um, yeah, so the lag was actually sort of your FPS was like dropping down to like 10, 5, 20 sort of FPS. So it was like really jolty constantly. Um, for some people, it's still bad. So uh, apparently they've they're uh, working on that. So that was good. I think it's a bit bad because. They like they beta tested I think the Xbox 360 version, but they didn't do the same with um, the PS3 and PC. So they just basically took the PS uh, 360 version, changed the controls and increased the graphics a bit, and then put it on a disc and shipped out for PC without really testing it, testing it. So that's uh, that just shows that they really do need to start releasing betas. Uh, here I'm using the RCXD car. Uh, it's not my it's. I like it. A lot of people don't really like it, but I like it. Apart from not being able to drive it very well, seeing people, and then by the time I get over to them, they're dead. And there's a guy just there. But I don't get him because he gets shot. So, yeah, I like the RC cars apart from they're very low kill streaks, so they're very easy to get for a lot of people. So, but they're fun, you know, and there's all those little holes you can drive through a map. So, I like that element of the game. I like all the stuff they've added to the game, like. The Dead Ops arcade and stuff, and then I haven't really tried played the zombie mode much, but I'll probably probably play that soon. So anyway, this patch I think they should have just made it so that perhaps your scope in time was longer, or perhaps make it so the scope in time was really awkward, like in World at War, because I remember the World and War scope in time was horrible. No, not scope in time, but like the way it scoped in, it scoped in all awkwardly, so people weren't really inclined to do it much. Like the reason why they used the PTRS and the Springfield was because because okay, because of the damage and stuff, but also because the way it came, the scope came up and down, it looked smoother. Whereas the most no gun was a bit sort of, um, what's the word, bulky. This guy just awareness fail. I take him out. So yeah, so um, yeah, probably gonna do some more Black Ops videos. Got a few, got a little mini targe. This is that's when I didn't have a clue how to use theater mode, so it's got all the theater mode stuff on the bottom, but. I've got another couple of clips. Uh, I'm definitely am sniping in this game. Uh, just gotta get used to it, you know, because you can quick scope. And you, it's just, especially because um, for Xbox 360 users and stuff, quick scoping is so easy in black in uh, like MW2 than it was on PC. Because like 
because you also had, you had aim assist, so quick scoping PC was a lot harder, so now it's even harder, but that way it takes more skill, you don't get all these fanboys just trying to do it, so that's all good. Yep, so overall this is a good game, and I like it. Uh, you never know when you get a bit, of, a bit annoyed when you're not doing very well, or but apart from that, I'm really pleased that they brought back dedicated servers, because that way I can minimise my lag. And overall this is a good game, I'm probably going to, I don't know if I'm going to go all the way to 14, I might just go, so I've got all 10, so go up to 10. Just stop so gold classes, but you know, having gold guns is quite tempting. So, anyway, just want to talk about the game a bit. Uh, since this was my first game, I, I thought oh, I'd defend uh, the, is the A bomb. I think it's the A bomb. So, that's why I was always going up the side, and then when I was attacking, I was like, well, it's actually probably quite easy to attack. So, and the reason why I'm just waiting here is because I know one, the bombs have been planted, and I know people in any Call of Duty game always want to push up. In competitive, like I've played some competitive matches, and what I know you don't do is you don't rush up around a corner like that guy just did. You wait on them, because that's why I'm. I play a lot smarter than I used to. Like I'd have just ran in, like yeah, woo, but you don't do that anymore. You don't play smart. So the game's coming to an end. Nasco gets the kill around about now, I think, and it's pretty good. So I'll see you in the next one, guys. End score seven to zero, and yeah, subscribe rate like